In your health tonight, a Connecticut company with cutting edge health care technology. Their latest breakthrough benefits breast cancer patients. News 8's medical reporter Jocelyn Mementa got an up close look at this new high tech tool. Jocelyn. The name of the company, Anna Darren, is Cub Tech and it's located in Milford and manufactures digital x ray systems shipped all over the world. The people who work there have come up with a way to apply digital technology where it can really benefit patients. It's a small company, but it's going beyond the surface in the high tech world. This is Cub Tech, tucked away in a corner of this warehouse facility in Milford. Vikram Batani heads it up. Cub Tech is based on the cutting edge technology of digital x ray. What we bring is the ability to do the highest resolution images with as low a radiation dose as is possible. For 11 years, this tight group of innovators has applied that cutting edge technology to develop a number of breakthrough devices. Among them, this low dose imaging tool for premature babies. Our focus is to improve the quality of care while reducing the cost to the hospitals. That really is the biggest challenge in today's economy. This is the latest rollout and it benefits breast cancer patients. So we took 3D mammography and have incorporated this technology into a patented system that is actually used to find the entire cancer the first time. This is the FDA approved Mozart system. It's the only system that uses 3D tomosynthesis to give surgeons a real time three dimensional image of a, of a uh, tumor specimen. Marketing director John Leach says it provides a clearer advantage for surgeons still currently relying on older models. They cannot tell you the location of the tumor within the specimen. Therefore the surgeon makes their best guess that they've removed all the tumor. So the advantage is you're looking at this tumor completely unobscured by the surrounding tissue. That you know not just that you, the tumor is there but you know where it is and you also know where it isn't. For patients? We know that 25% of the time, patients have to come back for a second surgery. It reduces the number of re-excisions that they may have to have, and it gives them a better cosmetic outcome. The company's technology also has a non-clinical application. It has been used in forensics as well as in research. And just this week, it was honored for its healthcare advancements in the industry. For more information, log on to WTNH.com.